Here's one of the dirty little secrets about success. Success isn't about taking action. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I'm a big believer in the importance of taking action and taking the right action. The problem is that taking action isn't enough. Here's why. I once had a problem downloading an update for my antivirus software. The download seriously crashed my computer. I couldn't get it to work. I called the software manufacturer and spoke with several customer service reps. They all explained what I should do to fix the problem. I did those things, but the problem still wasn't fixed. I finally had to hire an outside computer consultant to reinstall my hard drive, and it cost me three times more than the price of the antivirus software. I consider the customer service reps I spoke with zeros. They all took action, but none of them helped me solve my problem. So what's the difference between a zero and a hero? Zeros take action, but heroes take responsibility. Actions are an input, results are an output. Have you taken responsibility for the results you create in your life? I observe many who are just going through the motions. Activity has become an anesthesia for them. They feel better by doing something even if what they're doing isn't working. If your effort isn't effective, you need to try something new or something different. Don't be content with activity. Commit to accomplishment. And here's a bonus idea. Take responsibility for problems you didn't create. Many years ago when Herb Kelleher was the CEO of Southwest Airlines, he got a letter from a disgruntled customer of another airline. The man wanted Herb to know how bad his competition was. What did Herb Kelleher do? He wrote back to the man and gave him a free ticket to anywhere Southwest flew to compensate him for the problem someone else had created. In doing so, Herb Kelleher won a customer for life. If you're a leader, you need to take responsibility. And sometimes that means solving problems you didn't create.